everybody, it's Pelfrey. And uh, I wanted to take a, a couple minutes here to talk about something that I read this past week. Um, if you don't know already, Dr. Foster and Smith um, put out a notice that they were closing their online store um, in February. Now, from what I understand, Live Aquaria and Divers Den will be left alone uh, for the time being anyway. Now, the way that I understand it is uh, Dr. Foster and Smith and Petco are associated, whereas I believe Petco bought out Dr. Foster and Smith. So there's some speculation on why the online retailer is closing, and uh, there's always going to be speculation as to why they're closing. The truth is, unless you're an executive for one of the companies, you're never going to know the true answer. Uh, the most important part of this is that this is uh, apparently a small part of Wisconsin, and um, there's like 300 people that are gonna be out of a job. And I've worked for companies before that have downsized dramatically. And I've worked for companies before that, um, after I've left anyway, they've, they've shut the doors. And it's hard to um, find jobs to begin with, let alone whenever you uh, close the doors of a company and you have a market saturated um, with, with people just looking for any type of work. Um, you know, I don't, I don't know what their work life uh, is or what their benefits are like, but. Uh, obviously, you know, benefits, and if they do a 401k match, all of that is uh, pretty significant, especially if anybody's worked there for any amount of time. Um, so that's the, the biggest downfall to all of this, obviously, is that folks aren't going to lose their job because of this, and hopefully um, they can find their job, a new job, pretty quickly, uh, even if they're willing to relocate, which sometimes, you know, tends to help a little bit. But... Um, yeah, if you haven't heard already, Dr. Foster and Smith has uh, announced that they're going to close uh, their online store, and that's it for everything. Um, apparently, uh, I didn't know this, but they're big time into um, like uh, pharmacy end of things, which is pretty cool. I didn't know that about them. Every time I got on there, it was for fish stuff. I uh, didn't order from them very often, but uh, you know, I looked on there from time to time. But the other part of this is be on the lookout for deals. Uh, last week there was a coupon code that had something to do with like flea and tick, but it worked on Radeon stuff, uh, Ecotech stuff. Now, it's pretty rare to see Ecotech go on sale because it's uh, controlled by Mac pricing. Uh, this was a 15% coupon that worked with Ecotech, the, the MP40s, the MP10s, the, the Radeons, all of them. Now, I didn't buy uh, any more Radeons. I don't need any, have any use for Radeons and I didn't buy any MP10s or MP40s, uh, but I did get some titanium, uh, Phoenix titanium heaters with that code. So I saved, you know, 13, 14 bucks. Um, but just be on the lookout. Um, you know, it's, again, it's unfortunate and I don't want to, to say, well, you know, hooray, we're gonna get a good deal because of this, because at the end of the day, it does suck. People are gonna lose their job and there's people that are actually willing to work uh, that are working for the company right now, and since they're a, a non-unionized um, facility, it, it's not going to matter on seniority if they keep um, the people that have been there the longest first, the people that have been there the longest may be the first to be let go. So, but again, uh, just keep your eyes open, and um, you know, obviously if you have any uh, negative comments about this, in the comment section below I'm going to uh, delete them just because it's completely uncalled for. Uh, a lot of people are struggling and suffering with this. but. On the flip side, it is going to offer some of us reefers um, or pet lovers in general maybe the chance to snag some equipment or some dry goods, uh, food or whatever uh, for a discounted price. And again, if you have animals, uh, other animals, dogs, cats, whatever, be on the lookout for that. So I'm going to go ahead and cut this off here. Let me know what you think about it in the comment section below. Please keep it clean. Uh, I can't imagine anybody would take this down the wrong path, but uh, yeah, let's have a discussion about it below. And uh, tell me what you think about it. As always, appreciate you watching, following along. I'll see you on the next one.